In mathematics, a monotonic function is a function between ordered sets that preserves the given order. This concept first arose in calculus, and was later generalized to the more abstract setting of order theory. Monotonicity in calculus and analysis. In calculus, a function defined on a subset of the real numbers with real values is called monotonic if and only if it is either entirely increasing or decreasing. It is called monotonically increasing, if for all and such that one has, so preserves the order. Likewise, a function is called monotonically decreasing if, whenever, then, so it reverses the order. If the order in the definition of monotonicity is replaced by the strict order, then one obtains a stronger requirement. A function with this property is called strictly increasing. Again, by inverting the order symbol, one finds a corresponding concept called strictly decreasing. Functions that are strictly increasing or decreasing are one-to-one -one when functions between discrete sets are considered in combinatorics. It is not always obvious that increasing and decreasing are taken to include the possibility of repeating the same value at successive arguments. So one finds the terms weakly increasing and weakly decreasing to stress this possibility. The terms non-decreasing and non-increasing should not be confused with the negative qualifications not decreasing and not increasing. For example, the function of figure 3 first falls, then rises, then falls again. It is therefore not decreasing and not increasing, but it is neither non-decreasing nor non-increasing. The term monotonic transformation can also possibly cause some confusion because it refers to a transformation by a strictly increasing function. Notably, this is the case in economics with respect to the ordinal properties of a utility function being preserved across a monotonic transform. A function is said to be absolutely monotonic over an interval if the derivatives of all orders of a non-negative at all points on the interval. Some basic applications and results the following properties are true for a monotonic function. Has limits from the right and from the left at every point of its domain. Has a limit at positive or negative infinity of either a real number, or can only have jump discontinuities can only have countably many discontinuities in its domain. These properties are the reason why monotonic functions are useful in technical work in analysis. Two facts about these functions are, if is a monotonic function defined on an interval then is differentiable almost everywhere on, i.e., the set of numbers in such that is not differentiable in has Leber's game measure zero. In addition, this result cannot be improved accountable. See Cantor function. If is a monotonic function defined on an interval then is Riemann integrable. An important application of monotonic functions is in probability theory. If is a random variable, its cumulative distribution function is a monotonically increasing function. A function is unimodal if it is monotonically increasing up to some point and then monotonically decreasing. When is a strictly monotonic function, then is injective on its domain, and if is the range of, then there is an inverse function on for monotonicity and topology, a map f. X, Y is said to be monotone if each of its fibers is connected i.e., for each element Y and Y the set F-1 is connected. Monotonicity in functional analysis In functional analysis on a topological vector space X, A operator T, X, X is said to be a monotone operator if Kacharovsky's theorem shows that convex functions on Banach spaces have monotonic operators as their derivatives. A subset G of X times X is said to be a monotone set if for every pair U1, W1, and U2, W2 in G. G is said to be maximal monotone if it is maximal among all monotone sets in the sense of set inclusion. The graph of a monotone operator G is a monotone set. A monotone operator is said to be maximal monotone if its graph is a maximal monotone set. Monotonicity in order theory. Order theory deals with arbitrary partially ordered sets and pre-ordered sets in addition to real numbers. 
The above definition of monotonicity is relevant in these cases as well. However, the terms increasing and decreasing are avoided, since their conventional pictorial representation does not apply to orders that are not total. Furthermore, the strict relations less than and greater than are of little use in many non-total orders and hence no additional terminology is introduced for them. A monotone function is also called isotone, or order-preserving. The dual notion is often called antitone, antimonotone, or order-reversing. Hence, an antitone function f satisfies the property x, y implies f, f, for all x and y in its domain. The composite of two monotone mappings is also monotone. A constant function is both monotone and antitone. Conversely, if f is both monotone and antitone, and if the domain of f is a lattice, then f must be constant. Monotone functions are central in order theory. They appear in most articles on the subject and examples from special applications are found in these places. Some notable special monotone functions are order embeddings f and order isomorphisms. Monotonicity in the context of search algorithms. In the context of search algorithms monotonicity is a condition applied to heuristic functions. A heuristic H is monotonic if, for every node N and every success N, of N generated by any action A, the estimated cost of reaching the goal from N is no greater than the step cost of getting to N, plus the estimated cost of reaching the goal from N. This is a form of triangle inequality, with N, N, and the goal G N closest to N. Because every monotonic heuristic is also admissible, monotonicity is a stricter requirement than admissibility. In some heuristic algorithms, such as A**, the algorithm can be considered optimal if it is monotonic. Boolean functions In Boolean algebra, a monotonic function is one such that for all i and by in 0, 1, if a1 b1, a2 b2, and bn, then ff. In other words, a Boolean function is monotonic if, for every combination of inputs, switching one of the inputs from false to true can only cause the output to switch from false to true and not from true to false. Graphically, this means that a Boolean function is monotonic when in its HESA diagram there is number 1 connected to a higher zero. The monotonic Boolean functions are precisely those that can be defined by an expression combining the inputs using only the operators and an OR. For instance, at least 2 of A, B, C hold is a monotonic function of A, B, C, since it can be written for instance as OR OR. The number of such functions on n variables is known as the Dedekind number of n. Bibliography Bartle, Robert G. The Elements of Real Analysis Gratzer, George. Lattice Theory First Concepts and Distributive Lattices ISBN 0-7167-0442-0 Pemberton, Malcolm, Rao, Nicholas. Mathematics for Economists An Introductory Textbook Manchester University Press. ISBN 0-7190-3341-1. Renardi, Michael and Rogers, Robert C. An Introduction to Partial Differential Equations. Texts in Applied Mathematics 13. New York. Springer Verlag. P. 356. ISBN 0-387-00444-0. Rees, Frigis and B. Acute L.A.'s Oak Falvey Nagy. Functional Analysis. Courier Dover Publications. ISBN 978-0-486-66289-3. Russell, Stuart J. Norvig, Peter. Artificial Intelligence. A Modern Approach. Upper Saddle River, New Jersey. Prentos Hall. ISBN 978-0-13-604259-4. Simon, Carl P. Bloom, Lawrence. Mathematics for Economists. ISBN 978-0-393-95733-4.